Hello everybody, I am Shepels and welcome back to Let's Play Unreal 2. So last time we got a great welcome back uh party where uh oh we um basically got shot down and attacked by Scar. Not exactly my plan of a welcome home party. I I must say. And I can't see there being anything much over that direction, so I'm not going to go that direction. Instead, I am going to go up. Yeah, uh, let me see. How's my ammunition going? Uh, ah, a bit of a flamethrower might do the trick against some of these boys. Yeah, torch them. Up we go. Ah, let's have a look. Ah, good views from this elevator, I have to say. Marvelous. Then somebody goes and ruins it with all these sound effects. All these sound effects of death. Look, I am trying to torch you, Mr. Scar. Why are you not dying? There we go. I will take that if you don't mind. Okay, that that didn't work too well. Let's just continue. I'll try the shotgun. They're fucking tough, I'll say that much. Ah, oh, here we go. There we go. Shotgun does come in handy. But the only time it's ever been actually of any use to me. Hmm. I believe they're having a bit of shader trouble here. I don't think it's supposed to be that black. Hmm. I think there was a little bit of shader problems there. That's for sure. Or lighting problems at least. Right. Oh, holy Jesus. Hmm. This isn't gonna be easy, is it? Alright then, let's, uh. Yeah, let's do it this way. And then the game goes and fucking frame rates like ass. Did I kill both of them? No. Why is it going so fucking slow? What is wrong with the frame right here? I do not know. But I don't care now because it seems to be going okay now. There's some health over here as well. And the shield. Now let's shoot. Let's uh, bring this thing down. Turn it off. Hmm. That did it. The good news, John, you're not alone. I'm patching you through the submarines nearby. McMillan here, Bravo Squad Leader. Our 20 is the building directly below the landing pad. We've set up a perimeter and can hold indefinitely. Get over there, John. I'll bring the Atlantis down and pick up a lot of you. On my way. See you soon, McMillan. Walk in the park, sir. Walk in the bark, sir. Yeah, there's not going to be many of them left, is there? I am such a downer. I'm so negative sometimes, aren't I? But it's the truth, there's not going to be many of them left. There never is in games or movies. Most of them die within about the first five minutes. So where exactly am I supposed to be heading to here? Hmm, lots of canisters down there. That means that I'm probably going to end up going down there. Where there's canisters, there's explosives. Where there's explosives, there's enemies. The scar cut the power. Stand by. Emergency should kick in any second. Oh, great. God damn, backup's out. Can you get down without power? Not unless I take the scar free-for-all express. Huh. I prefer a ride I can walk away from. 
Christ! I'll send out a man to fix the generator. Can you find a good vantage point to give him cover? That's why God invented the sniper rifle. <laughs> That's why God invented the sniper rifle. I'm at the door. I see it. I'm outside. Objective in sight. Path looks clear. I'm near the fire. Yeah, I see you, buddy. Move on in. I in the sky has got you covered. Oh my god. Got a scar here. Where? There we go. Thought that scar had me. Not at all. Not at all. Looking good so far. I'm gonna blow the fence. Yep, you do that. Any day now. Freaking scar! Jesus! Got him. I'm there. Looks like it took a stray hit, but I can patch it. I'll need some time. You got as much time as I got ammo. Not a lot. Come on. I can't fucking shoot him. God. Oh my goodness. Yeah, baby. All right. Talk about spaghetti. Who designed this? Almost <laughs> got it. Yep. I'll tell you who designed it. Some military asshole that did it on the cheap. That's who. Might want to hurry up there, Marine. I do not have all day. Always wanted a guardian angel. Got you covered. Almost done. Yeah, you've got a fucking guardian angel, all right. It's me. There's just one problem. You've got a fucking scar coming in hot with a bloody mech suit on him. And he looks pissed. Then you've got another one. And I'm going to blow the shit out of him. Ooh. Bingo! Got it! Tougher than I thought! Well then, get your... Marshal, I appreciate the cover, but you'd better catch that elevator before the scar catch on. Gotcha. Well, that was a pain in the ass. Fun! But a pen in the ass. At least I wasn't in the firing range for once. Still, nice views on the elevator. All we need is some elevator music. Do 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 do. You know, like a really sort of cheesy elevator music. Let's go. Yelzy's on top. We need to work our way up there. Follow me. Sure thing. Sure. Like him? I'm guessing just like him then. Right, I've got your six. Move on. Uh oh. Where's my race? Uh I'm trying to get a clear shot. Come on. How hard is it to fucking shoot these? <sighs> yeah, you, can, you might be able to stop the car, but you can't stop a sniper rifle. Too damn strong for you, Scar. Hmm. Let's see what we got. We've got concussion, frag, toxic, and incinerator. I have no intentions on leaving your side. Because if it means that they target you instead of me for once, I'm fucking happy. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. 
it's actually nice to not have to go against other fucking human characters that have ridiculous fucking accuracy and can kill you with a shotgun from god knows how many meters. Hmm. I'll just mess him up a bit. Now, now I'm having fun. Oh, it's one of them ones. Back when I first fought you, or one of your buddies, I didn't have a rocket launcher. So I'm not afraid of you now. Uh, I'm guessing my buddy didn't make it. Damn. Oh well. He was a good soldier. Why did he last it? He died without a name. I will call him Mac Spittles. Good stuff. Position, Ida. Anytime you're ready. On my way. Do I see stuff down there? Indeed, let's move. Well, that would explain why there's supplies down here. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna take those supplies very, very I kindly. Well, then you go do that, then. I'm not gonna stop you. That's it. Set her up. And I'm gonna sit on top of this rock. And I'm gonna blast any single scar that comes around this corner. And the turrets will let me know from exactly what direction they're coming from. Here they come. There we go. Yeah! How's about some rockets? There we go. I can survive against Scar. Human enemies, though, are a different beast altogether. Human enemies are just fucking horrible to try and beat. Um, right, I don't know what weapon to use now. Ow, that did hurt, I must admit. Ow. Ow. I will. What the fuck? Okay, we're gonna have to do this differently. It's gonna be like that, is it? Alright, so. Alright, so here they come. So this time, I'm going to use this. The only problem is, it's not very effective against those big ass suits of theirs. So if I can get them, and if it takes them down, I don't really care. Any time now would be really appreciative. Come on. What are those goddamn blasts? Come on. I really don't want to get caught in the middle of this. Because I can't see. Because those bloody shots of theirs are all shiny and bright. I don't know what to do with them. Come on. There we go. Now it's starting to feel a bit more like Unreal. I'll get 
Keep us up. You fly the ship. Huh. Our shields will not take another hit. What's going on up there, Ida? I'll explain later. Hold on. Great. So. No, it's not. Hit the reserves. We're being. <laughs> Good old Isaac. You gotta love Isaac. He's, he's like, you know. You know, he's what Isaac Clark should have been. In Dead Space. It if Isaac Clark was more like that Isaac, that'd be awesome. What just happened? Ah, God damn it! No, it's not. Let's try it's this reserves. again. Fly, you son of a bitch! <laughs> Fly, you son of a bitch! Let's go. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna let the turrets do some work for me too. What the hell? Whoa. This is no, easy. That's it, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna send those things after them. There we go. See how you like them boys. I never really used that, so I was just kind of wondering how it worked. God damn it. Those things are highly explosive. I'm trying not to get hit with them. God. I'm trying to dodge here and it's not working very well. What good are those goddamn turrets? They don't seem to be holding them down much at all. There we go. He's making another pass. Brace for impact. They sound like they're having a whale of a time. I heard that from down here. Transmission. Woo! Jesus Christ. Whoa! Ida! Ida! Damn. Shit. So this is Hawkins Dorian Gray flagship, eh? That's a big ass ship. Damn. The Cut. Atlantis is gone, John. Shot down. We did a search and rescue, but nothing. I'm sorry. After we picked you up, we recovered the artifacts from the wreckage and brought them up here to the Dorian Gray. Once we had them all, we were able to decipher the glyphs. They tell of an ancient race, the Tosk. Noble warriors who served their masters in battle. But when there were no more masters to serve, their scientists hid their DNA within that of another race and forged these artifacts against the day they might once again be needed. The race that contains their DNA is still with us today. The Kai. Oh. Really? Isn't that the cook? A warrior Kai? You're right. I don't get it. <laughs> Over time.
time, the artifacts became scattered across the planets. If we are the ones to reunite them, the Tosk will serve us with weapons of awesome power. I see where this is going. I will be their new master. And I will wield these weapons on behalf of the Earth in our battle with the Scar. It is possible that the glyphs lie, or that we have read them incorrectly. But I'm willing to take that chance with certain precautions. Only one guy in a containment chamber with you and those men standing by in case something goes wrong. This is gonna go horribly wrong. I am putting the final artifact in place. This is gonna go horribly wrong. Yeah. That was the cock. Hot damn. They're not so friendly now, are they? Or at least they don't look like it. And of course, Drexler goes and fucking legs it and leaves me stuck in here along with the other marines to handle this on our own. Yeah. Did anybody seriously think this was ever going to go right? God damn it. They're able to like fire an, almost a black hole out of their hand. This is really not working well. I don't know where I've even disappeared to or or what. Holy damn. Artifact in place. I don't even know what to use. Well, I suppose the Magnum's a start. Fucking hell. That was the cook? I am taking out this. There's health stations and everything there. But I can't get to it. Oh, this thing is going to get so pissed. Just... I'm just going to fucking open fire on it with everything I got. That includes the Magnum. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. It's almost like a fucking BFG. This is insane. I'm not quite sure how this is supposed to work, but yeah, and they're not very fucking friendly, are they? I would very much prefer to keep them the way they were. At least they were helpful and friendly as long as you were polite to them. These things are hostile. And, uh, not so friendly. There we go. There are three things in... okay. Okay, well, it's down now. Or... Maybe not, but at least it's lost its weapon. Can I pick it up? Singularity cannon. I love it. Bye!
Okay. So that is exactly what it is. It's a, basically a gun that makes a black hole. Oh, this is going to work really well, isn't it? And what exactly is the purpose of having this? Like, I don't Right, I'm, I'm going to go and charge my shields first, but then I'm going to leave it for this part. And I'm going to... You know, then we're going to finish it in the next one. But I'm really not sure about this. Alright, let's, uh, let's just heal me up. Well, not fully health, but charge up my shields. This was always, always, always going to go horribly, horribly wrong. Ah, when will mankind ever learn? Well, I already know the answer to that. Never! Okay. Let's go. So, we gotta go over here. Like so. And... Then I'm going to leave it here for this part. Yeah, definitely. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed the video. And as always, I will see you in the next one. Thank you, and have fun.